Hello and welcome back to another episode of Europe Universalis 4 as we continue our game with the Holy Roman Empire. This is a game we started as Brandenburg, if you guys recall. We are in the middle of the war uh, against the coalition. Why not? It's always against the coalition from now on, with the exception of Great Britain, that they are still not in it. They will be though. They will be. And yep, the reason for this war? Well, I felt like it. No point whatsoever in this already, but well, it sounds like fun, so why not? We are first, second, first. We are making tons of uh, score each month. We take, we have taken this slowly, so that that's fine. That's fine by me. Um, we are in the war with Spain, Hungary, Cologne, Guyenne, Galicia, Burgundy, Ireland, Austria, France, Tuscany, Tripoli, Russia, and Algiers. Yep, I said it with one breath. Uh, so we, the the plan for now is to take their capitals, each and every one of their capitals. Uh, well, the most important ones, at least. I'm not going for Galicia, and I'm not going for Algiers. But uh, Madrid, I will take it. Uh, we are taking Ile de France. We are taking Burgogne. Uh, we are taking Firenze, and we have taken Pest. I'm not sure if I will take uh, Saint Petersburg. Well, they don't have St. Petersburg because we have that province. Interesting. So their capital is still Novgorod? Moskov. Novgorod is here. So their capital is still Moskva. Well, why not? Let's let's go there. Siege 3? Yeah, that's fine. Let's go there. there. Let's go there. Okay. We are in the process of vassalizing Norway. Uh, it will be through diplomatic means. I want to get all of the Baltic. Do they have colonies up here? They don't though. Yeah, that's a bummer. Well, we'll get this over here, so all in all, not bad. Norwegian pe peasants. Yeah, that's fine. They are only allied with us? No, they are still allied with Cologne apparently. Alright, so let's uh, keep this going. Splendid claim on Savoy. Terrific. That will be one province that we will take then. Try and take at least. Uh, let me see this battle around here. I'm not concerned. We will win it, I think. Uh, even though we are facing terrible odds. Well. Yeah, all it takes is one good roll for them to completely crumble. There, now it's 2 to 1. And look at the morale. This is how strong Brandenburg is. Right, so apparently the, these guys are not doing anything here. Let's uh, make them do this. And let's take a look over here. Yeah, that's fine. 41%? What? Let me see, what kind of peace deal would we be able to make? Super peace, uh, clear offers. 14. Spain is making gains, really, truly? You are, you consider you are making gains? Well, the Ottomans might as well. Really, the Ottomans have no army. Ugh, God damn it. Well, dumbasses. Siege of Burgon is over. Terrific. Now we'll go for Spain. What the hell? Let's go for Spain. I'm tired of these guys considering they are making gains. Ugh. They keep losing the battles against me. They won a few against my allies and they think they are making gains. What the hell? Uh. Such dumbasses. This battle is going on for what? Uh, four months? And now it's stopped. The casualties, really? Really? Oh, for crying out loud. Alright, we need to bring reinforcements over there. Oh, God damn it. Like, it... <sighs> I have no words for this, really. 
this is such a dumb thing to have if you guys don't understand what we are seeing right here I'll explain they have a couple of armies on this side of battle over here they have none as you guys can see and they are dumb enough not to regroup well the AI because we cannot control this is dumb enough not to regroup on this side of battle or on this side because this this army right here impulse and infantry can only attack these three this guy can only attack these three. The cavalry can attack four, I think. Uh, no, uh, these this three and this one, if it existed, which it does not. Uh, so, yep, yeah, they are here, but they cannot attack. Because we have no troops here to attack these, and they have no troops over here to attack these. So, yep, yeah, that's how dumb this battle is going. And now we'll, we are locked there forever, until well, until I bring reinforcements to fulfill those lines, to fill those lines. Ugh. Honestly. There. Such a dumb thing. Scrap our troops. Well, they are going there. Terrific. Siege of Firenze is over. Lovely. <sighs> that was truly, truly... Ugh. I have no words for that one. That's a crazy-ass bug, if you ask me. So we won an yet another battle. Siege of Pedigord is over. Alright, let's go to Pity now then. Well, actually, no. Hang on. Alright, yes. Pity now. Um, we are losing money, apparently. Siege of Moskva and Assam declare war upon Koch. Koch. Let's get the uh, this army then. Yeah, they have their capital occupied, but they still don't do anything. Let's see our exhaustion, by the way. <coughs> from attrition, yeah. We are taking a couple from attrition. Hmm, but love the Gas Gascon, we won. Nothing surprising there. By the way, I'm striking right into Madrid because right now the the way the Shattered Retreat works is they well, we can actually retreat all the way over to our territory, so that is why I'm doing this. 35% Persia against Mughals. Uh, at most importance. Let's grab these guys and move them back up. And keep keep in mind that we, are, we have one army in reserve. And, well, we still have the manpower all the way to the top. Let's see how the manpower of the... Our enemy's manpower is faring, how it is faring. So, uh, alright, let's go Austria. They have this manpower, but they, all f they are fully occupied. So, Aragon is not our enemy, I think. Um, France, they have 95,000 manpower. They still have 156,000 troops. Well, that's fine. Uh, Guyenne, 352. Burgundy, yeah, that's what I was... Uh, looking for 439 Spain uh, well Russia 277 yeah Russia is the one that has the most uh, after us I think Spain 985 yeah and you are making gains right mm -hmm. good luck with it Galicia and their military alliance with Spain <coughs> sorry about that 85,000, they are going to try and strike at us. Grab this army, move it there. Uh, how many? In Siege 3, yeah, definitely. We should probably be, be able to win n n n anyway, but well, why risk it? As you guys can see, we are taking, we are giving a lot of pain on to these guys. Uh, utmost importance, and now with this they will retreat. 
no questions about it. Uh, you will stay there, and then you will go there. We'll, we'll go over here. By the way, let me see what kind of sieges they are doing. Well, this is kind of a bummer. Yeah, let's merge these guys all here. Let's patrol Venice there. Now, you guys, you have 97 troops there. Are you patrolling? You are, aren't you? Right, so we are taking tons of money from... Uh, we are suffering tons of... Uh, well, being uh, over the force limits is giving us 108.51 uh, more uh, upkeep. That's fine. Oh, right. I wanted to see something. Uh, let's take off the fleet. The fleets, 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 navies. Right, I wanted to see this. Uh, it's all fine. Straight of Dover, we won it. And this one will win as well. Well, they actually lost all of their ships. Interesting. And another battle. The Ottomans are uh, doomed. Look at this. <laughs> this is so funny. Well, we we have we are to blame for the Ottomans being this weak. We we broke them a couple of times. So it took three years to siege through this, but it is finally done. Uh, let's put these guys in force march because I want to catch these guys. Siege of Pity now is over. Lovely. Let's go to Aragon. Six hundred, seven hundred thousand. Yeah. And they lost all of their all their entire army. And there. Yeah, this is how strong we are right now. Let's move there. Let's crush these uh, these guys. Uh, they apparently have more troops than we do. That's fine. If they wish to believe that, they are free to do so. So we won that. Let's go over there. I want the Ottomans to make peace first. Make their, their separate peace with Spain. And then I'll make have a peace with them and trust me it's not going to be, pre to be pretty Charlone uh, they probably go there revolutionary war against Norway apparently they are not moving there there another battle one we'll use these guys to crush these little armies siege of Nemours lovely let's do this uh, minus 14 in Dorpat Right next to me. How dare you? We have any sieges up here? No, we don't. We have a couple of sieges here. Right next to me yet again. So let's do this, this, and then this. Then you can move there again. Well, and Tuscany is trying to lift that siege. It's not going to work. There. Battle of Dorpat, and this battle will win, will win it as well. Without questions asked. Siege of Girona. Terrific, let's move to Barcelona. 35 per month. Oh, that's fine. And this siege is done, let's lift that one. They dare to say that they are making gains. Battle of Sopron. Right, this guy has no leader, that's why we are taking that many casualties. Yeah, that's fine. Let's move there. Let's 
Siege of Madrid is over. Now let's move to Toledo then. Let's move there. Battle of Toledo, we won it. Nothing surprising. This battle is still raging. That's mostly because this is uh, mountains, so the combat width is smaller. So, yep. Uh, Gascon, maybe? Oh, no. They actually just went to burn. Uh, select army. Let's take off the force march. It's, it was fun. Let's move there. Do you really want me to bring this fleet to lift this? Really? Alright, I'll do it. Revolt in St. Galen. Right, do we have a free army? Yes, we do. Let's move there and then to St. Galen to lift that. Boom. 2,000 troops. Wave bye bye. Huh, we lost that. Uh, let's stop patrolling. That's why I need a fleet. Move there. move god dang it there at most important wave bye bye yet again We'll move these guys over there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. God dang it. Really? Oh good, you did what I wanted. Siege in the Moors. What? Oh, they won this one. Really? Go there. I know, I'll lift that siege to just to get there, but eh, that's fine. Because this one will have really low... And we'll be able to do this. Now, how are the sieges faring? No leader. Move there. 91. Yeah, that cannot be allowed. Uh, to do invest. Merge, patrol, London. L London. Do you still consider to be making games? I guess not. So, uh, this one, this one, and that one, they won't accept. Yeah, I'm not sure if I want these. N Norway, Norway, minus 12. And if I don't take this one, no, no. Norway does not take anything good. And if I take this one, Norway. They do not take anything as well. Uh, but I don't 
know if I want to Kunio already. Well, what the hell, let's go for it. Let's go for it, what the hell. Now, an old treaty. No. Release nations, yes. Brazil. I cannot make them release Croatia. Colombia, cannot. Which is a bummer. Chill, chill, I can. Uh, UPCA. Peru. Mm. Brazil and Chile. Mexico. They don't accept. Do they have anything instead of Chile? Yeah, you will release a release better one then. Mexico. Orissa. UPCA. Yeah, I'll probably release UPCA. And give me money. Shall we do this? We'll take one province for ourselves. We'll release a couple of nations, thus weakening Spain. Sure, we'll do this. There. We gained the conquest against France, Russia, yeah. Alright, uh, let's move. You two move and you move. I'll sort them out later. Uh, Stockholm. Overextension. Yeah, I need to core. Cunio and Piedmont. And what else do I want to reduce this? We cannot convert yet. Cunio and Piedmont, they are Protestant already, so that is good. I need to flip the culture though, I don't want Castilians over here. Ugh. No, no, no. And let's see Norway. And I'm gonna enter the coalition. Yeah, that's fine. Norway. Uh, 117. Royal marriage. 142. Good. Relations. Improve relations. Come on. Let's speed up the game. Diplomat has arrived. Improve relations. That will be a plus 7. More coins. Yeah. Really? Good thing we have this one then. Oh, Great Britain entered the coalition against us. Really? Why? Let's improve relations. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Yeah, I need to split these guys up. Uh, Brandenburg. There, and Falls. Yeah, sure. You, uh, Poznan, and... <coughs> Excuse me. Damn. <coughs> Sorry about that. Treviso. Sure, this way they don't get any attrition. I think. Nope. We are still losing tons of money, though. We are losing tons and tons of money. You are patrolling? Nope. Venice. Bees. One fifty win one fifty five. God damn it. How did I want to make that? I really send gift. This is only twenty five. It's the maximum we can get. We can uh, improve. 25, so 180. Right, aggressive expansion needs to uh, lower a bit more. We are losing tons of money though. Where is our fleet? It's here. It's... Oh, it's repairing itself. 91%. Alright. Use caution. 
don't want to take any more inflation that I want that I need to. We lost the general, so we can recruit another one. It's a good one. It is a good one. Really? 128? Alright, let's convert this. St. Galen, uh, how much are we paying for being over the force limit? 185, oh, okay. It's a bit higher than I expected it to be. Alright, we have the fleet pretty much in, in place, I think, so next episode, mm, 18 more ships. Pretty soon we will declare war upon Great Britain, even if we have to face the coalition yet again. I really hope not, though. I really hope, though, we don't. Uh, coalition, conquer Ireland. Alright guys, so I'll put a cut here, hopefully you guys enjoy this one. If you did, please consider giving it a thumbs up, it really helps out the channel a lot. And I'll be seeing you guys next time, so until then, do take care and goodbye.